Joe. This is Freestyles with Drew and Spang. I'm like Spang, it. he's Drew. Makes me smile every time. Drew really likes when I say, I do. Joe. It's fun. And uh, so I, I'm going to try to do that Thank as you. often as appropriate. Um, right now we're going to be talking about someone who I've, I've followed on YouTube for a while. Um, yes. I also, was, doing, also having to do with music. And so and uh, same, also man. with health problems. Yeah. Um, so, I mean, we yes. have a weird theme. Um, yeah. But I, I did subscribe to him for a while. I'll admit I'm not subscribing to him anymore just because he comes up with so many videos. Yeah, it's um, ridiculous. But if Very you productive. haven't if you haven't seen this guy, um, his name is like Beaner Kiki something on uh, on face or on YouTube. I mean, mm -hmm. um, just YouTube like like lip synced Katy Perry songs or something. This kid is is uh, uh, 15 years old. 15 maybe yeah, 16 so. years old um he has a uh, mps6 is what they call it but basically it's a it's a form of uh i want to be sensitive with the word i choose i think it's dwarfism is the correct term to use right um and he's battling with that he constantly i didn't realize how much goes into this He's constantly in and out of the hospital. Mm -hmm. um, he's apparently a big influence on a lot of other people who have this type of disease. He has to go to the hospital for uh, getting growth hormones, getting yep. multiple surgeries just to stretch out his bones. Yeah. Um, because his body's Dialysis still growing, too. but his bones are not. Yeah. And um, so he's going through a lot of stuff. We linked up to him. He's on our he's on our page on the Drew and Spang on the radio on mm -hmm. on. Uh, on our Facebook. He's also, uh, I mean, it's on YouTube. It was the biggest news thing earlier today. I don't know if it still yeah. is. I think it's cool because um, yeah. they said, I mean, he always comes out with videos. He started posting, a couple, what was it, a year or two ago. Yeah. And he just, he lip syncs. He doesn't sing really to the covers. Sometimes he does. Sometimes he does, but mostly he just lip syncs to popular songs. And I think and he, he just really has got no big. shame. He has no shame. He's he's a very, like, he makes me smile. He, he's just very uplifting, encouraging because Absolutely. they were saying in this little news spot that there's not a self conscious bone in his body. He's oh, yeah. Just, he's totally wants to make you smile, very, very easygoing. And so his videos are made to entertain. Yeah. himself and others and, and that's it he doesn't want to draw attention to himself or his condition really mm -hmm. he just wants to entertain people and so he got really popular with what Katy Perry I think Katy Perry was the first song because and it's really cool because Katy Perry not only noticed that it happened mm -hmm. but also if you watch this news clip wrote hey uh, you're my teenage dream and a link to his thing yeah and tweeted and, directly to him right and you think okay maybe some random person who runs her tweet thing mm -hmm. saw that but then you see a more personal one that says, I heart you, uh, Keenan Cahill, or whatever his name is. I think Keenan is his first name. Keenan, Keenan Cahill, yeah. I think that's right. Um, but, I mean, it's kind of cool that, like, multiple celebrities. He's been on Ellen. Yes. Um, and uh, on Ellen, 50 Cent shows up and raps. Yeah, that was E, Chelsea Handler. On, but yeah, oh, Chelsea Handler, excuse me. And rapped with him in one of his videos. And that's super cool. I mean, I don't condone 50 Cent, but as a 15-year-old boy, yeah. potentially 16-year-old boy, to be, I mean, to have a fa any famous person randomly show up in your room to do something right. that you randomly started doing as a stupid thing for fun, that's yeah. awesome. And I think each and, video that he posts, and right. he posts all the time but each one's getting well over three four million views and you you said it you know he's not trying to to point to his d condition or to his right or or to himself at all um you know other than he's having fun doing it but the fact that he is i mean he's not doing it intentionally but he is is really encouraging and uplifting mm -hmm. um you know for anybody who has a condition or thing that they're going through to see that like you can have that joy in it yeah and right now, I'm also, and, and this is kind of cool, I might throw something to this. Um, right now, I'm doing a, a report for my human sexuality class. And um, I'm doing it on um, AIDS and HIV. And I'm trying to go for the aspect of, like, how we as Christians should minister to people who have that. Because have one of the... Disabilities or something like that. Right. Well, I mean, for my thing, it's just about Specifically HIV. Specifically HIV. But, but to see, like, that there's joy with people who have, you know, all sorts of affliction where they, I feel like there's a temptation to give up. Oh, right. It's Absolutely. really, really morally and spiritually uplifting for me. And uh, so, I mean, watch that. It's really cool. I like finding cool things in media to th that lift up people. It's very nice. So watch that. Um, also, you know, he's number one. 
This yeah. guy is number one on YouTube. I think number he one. actually he really is the number one subscribed person on YouTube. He has like two million followers. He's pretty close to it, at least. Speaking of number one, AJ's going to stop typing right now and hit the number one song on this CD.